Wildcard winners and losers from Wednesday the 23rd, St. Louis. Sit down. St. Louis is still in the top five, but that's a tough loss for them. And even tougher loss is the Mets. Much needed win for them, and they lost to Tampa Bay. They actually gave Tampa Bay their first division championship since 2010. Yay, ticket take. And then Miami channeling the natural. Losing is a disease as contagious as polio. Losing is a disease as contagious as syphilis. And then the big wins on the day. Cincinnati, huge win over Milwaukee, making it harder for Milwaukee to stay in the race. Big win. Big win. And then Philadelphia, after losing three in a row to the Nats, pick up a win. They're outside the top five, but still in the race. So big win for Philadelphia. And then huge win for San Francisco, keeps them in the top five. And let's look at the races here. Again, there's St. Louis. That loss did hurt them, but they are still right there in the mix. And Cincinnati jumped Miami with that win, and Miami continuously tanking it. Um, you know, Miami's got to figure it out because they are slowly falling down the list. And then Giants um, right there holding the fifth spot. And then Philadelphia, that huge win, gets them right there half a game away. And then Brewers are also half a game away. So that's why it was such a big loss for the Brewers to lose. And then Mets in Colorado, just making it harder for yourselves. They keep losing, and there they are right on the outside. So we'll have to check again today on Thursday. Every day is just going to be clutch, and then it's going to come down to the last game of the season.